Hello everyone and welcome to a Farming Sim 22 tutorial. Today we're talking about oilseed radish and oilseed radish is a crop you will plant and then cultivate over it once it's harvestable and it'll turn into fertilizer. So let's look at how that works. You can use any cedar, uh, kind of any normal cedar. So if you go into cedars, you'll see these two leaves here. That is the sign, uh, the symbol for oilseed radish. So any of these that have that will be able to plant oilseed radish. So I have one here and let's fill it up with any big pallet or pallet. You can just go to seeds, go ahead and buy them and fill up your sower. So this is really just like any other crop. You can go over here and in the top left, you'll see refill cedar and then you'll get your seeds. You'll also see in the top left, select seed. So make sure that you hit Y and you can see in the bottom right, the symbol is changing and oilseed radish is right there. And then we'll go over to our field up here. So this field has no fertilizer state and I'll show the map so we can kind of look at how that works as this unfolds. So if we go to Soil composition here, we are at field 33, get rid of plowing and lime, and we'll see there's no fertilizer. So it's already cultivated so I can plant, I'm ready to plant. And we'll go ahead and just do a small line of oil seed radish here. Doesn't have to be pretty. And you can see it planting right there. So we'll just make a little line there and that should be good for the video. And then if we look at our growth, we'll have oil seed radish is this greenish color and you'll see we have it there. So that doesn't do anything for us yet. What we need to do is give it one day and it'll grow and be harvestable. So let's skip ahead one day. Okay, so it's been one day and you'll see that we have some oilseed radish here. And if we go to growing, you'll see that it's harvestable. If we go into our schedule, you'll notice way at the bottom, oilseed radish is plantable from March to October, but it's harvestable all year. And the nice thing about it is that it does not wither. I let it run for a whole year just to make sure. And it was always harvestable, so you can plant it whenever you want and then harvest it whenever you're ready. So now all you have to do to quote unquote harvest it is just cultivate over it. If you have a cedar that cultivates, this also works with those. And once you cultivate it, you'll notice that it goes away. And if we look at our fertilizer chart, you'll see that it's got one state of fertilizer. And now the really nice thing about oil cedar radish is in the same day, you can use a different type of fertilizer, so liquid, solid, manure, digestate, and go over that as well. And it'll go um, to the second dark blue fertilizer state. So we'll go over it. And again, we're kind of just working with very small areas here. And if we look at our map, you'll notice that this area that we just cultivated and then sprayed is now double fertilized all in the same day. And it doesn't matter which order you're, you do it in. So we already sprayed this. If I were to go over this little patch again with the cultivator, then all of this would be dark blue. So it's a really nice way to get two fertilizer states all in one day. It doesn't wither. Um, all you're really paying for are the seeds and the, the one day of waiting. And that is how you can fertilize your field with oilseed radish and notice that then um, this part is now ready for planting whatever I wish and it'll already be fertilized twice so then you don't have to worry about it. So I hope that helps. I hope you learned something about oilseed radish. Please leave a like, subscribe, or comment below if you have a question and of course have yourselves a very nice day.